Hello everyone, and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is about activating a powerful feature that is missing by default in Windows 11 Home Edition, which is the Group Policy Editor. This tool is essential for advanced system customization and management. But unfortunately, Microsoft does not include it in the Home Edition of Windows 11. But don't worry, in this video, I'll show you a simple and safe method to enable the group policy editor using a small batch file. This method is especially helpful for IT enthusiasts, students, and even home users who want more control over their system settings, just like you would in the Pro or Enterprise editions. As you can see, I have a copy of Windows 11 Home Edition, and it works without any problems. I just want to enable the group policy editor if I try to find the Group Policy Editor by opening the Run window and entering the shortcut gpedit.msc, I'm unable to open the Group Policy Editor because Windows 11 Home Edition doesn't have this feature by default. Therefore, it must be enabled. And to enable this feature, open a text file and then paste the following commands into the text file. I will leave the commands in the video description. These commands do not download anything. They simply unlock existing packages already included in the Home Edition, making it safe and offline. I will then save the file as a batch file. From the top, click on File, and from the menu, click on Save As. Then save the file to your desired location, or any other easily accessible location. Give it a descriptive name and .bat extension. And from the Save Type drop-down menu, select All Files and click the Save button. The batch file will be created immediately in the location you specified. You can close the text file now and run the batch file as administrator. Right-click on it and select Run as Administrator. Click Yes when prompted. A command prompt window will open and begin processing the required components. All you have to do now is wait for the process to complete. This may take a few minutes, depending on your system. Once the process is complete, you'll see a pause message. Just press any key to close the window. Now, I'll check that the Group Policy Editor is enabled after completing and opening the Group Policy Package on Windows 11 Home Edition. Open the Run window and enter gpedit.msc and click OK. The Group Policy Editor should now open on your Windows 11 Home Edition without any issues. And that's it for today's video. The Group Policy Editor has been enabled on your Windows 11 Home Edition. This gives you access to a powerful set of management tools usually reserved for pro and enterprise users. You can now manage advanced settings like Windows updates, privacy controls, and software restrictions. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like it and subscribe to my channel for more effective Windows tips and tricks. And if you have any questions or suggestions, share them in the comments. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.